All right, bud. I know, I know, I know. All right. gonna go for a walk now and we'll throw it a few more times um, he shouldn't be tired yet but he's he's taking breaks which is a sign he, he didn't get the activity that he should for his age huh Oliver huh all right all right <laughs> so uh, we just stopped in the middle of a slight run or jog really to uh, to stop and look at this little armadillo for those of you who have not seen an armadillo before, Oliver, you're not being very nice right now. <sighs> Here's an armadillo in the wild. <laughs> um, uh, these guys aren't the smartest. I'd, I'd say that, definitely. Um, what's that, Oliver? I don't even know if he notices it. Um, um, you definitely want to be careful because uh, they've been known to carry diseases, but I mean, just a, uh, a very interesting, interesting animal. All right guys, so today we're gonna do a quick unboxing. Now, I don't like to do unboxings all the time. Obviously I do them when I get um, certain, you know, certain livestock from certain people um, because I'm expecting them to be really good. Um, but um, yeah, this is from a fish fan member. This is from Priscilla MK. She has an Etsy page. She is an active member of the fish fam. She's done art for Corey. She's done uh, Corey of Aquarium Co-op. She's done art for Bob Steenfot. Um, I think, I know she's done art for, I think she just got done doing art for Nisi by the look of some of her, her goldfish art that she just did. Definitely looked like some Nisi goldfish there. And uh, I'm, I'm sure she's done art for some more people as well. I think she even did artwork for Manzanita Driftwood, which is a company in Houston. I think she did their Facebook art. Um, but yeah. Uh, so anyways, I, you know, I went to her Etsy shop after seeing Michael's unboxing. He did one as well. You can go check that out. Um, and uh, yeah, I wanted to grab, grab some prints. This will be the first ever legitimate art I've ever owned. Um, and uh, luckily enough, I just got back from Michael's, uh, the, the hobby store, and they were running a 60% off all picture frames deal. So I was able to get picture frames for all of these for, yeah, 60% off, which is really nice. But um, anyways, here are the prints. And, uh, uh, and these are, I, I really like them. So um, let's take a look at what we have here now it looks like I got some stickers in here as well which is uh, awesome because I also got some stickers from another person here but we've got her uh, celestial pearl danio her I believe that's her yeah that pea puffer rainbow fish angel fish CPD and the arowana and now I actually own her arowana shirt um, if you're looking for if you would like an arowana or a monster fish shirt she has a really really nice one it's on uh, it's on teespring and it is this arowana uh just coming out basically of a circle and um yeah that sticker didn't really do it justice but it is a beautiful picture um and she does all of these i believe are done with uh colored pencils like a watercolor color pencil i'm not sure but um like, I definitely go recommend that you check out her channel because in her channel she has a uh, she has a time lapse which I'll link. She has a time lapse of doing um, doing at least one of these, if not more, um, of these of, of these drawings. Um, and these are just prints, I believe, of the drawings. So um, oh, I'm excited about what's back there. But um, we'll start with uh, what's on top. Now we have a little angelfish, and um, I'll put like maybe I'll put current prices up somewhere on the screen like right there um, 
This is a little angelfish. Um, and this is a Bosmani rainbow, obviously. I think she did this one for Bob. Um, she's about to do one for me, maybe in like a month or so. And then we have a leopard frog pleco. And, and those are nice prints, too. And that's nice, you know, thick card. Um, and then there's that arowana I was telling you about. Now, you can get these in larger sizes. Uh, I'm a bit cramped in space. I don't have too many places that hang art. Where they could easily be seen, so I've got to I've got to take other like I got to take posters down is what I is what I have to do so I can actually hang these. Um, but there's that arowana and I have this on a shirt and it's definitely one of my favorite shirts. But uh, I mean that is just yeah that's 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 art. Um, all right, so we have these guys and then behind that, which this is this is really nice. I'm happy to have that big of one of these. Um, we have a Bosemani rainbow, and I believe this is 8x10, and these are 6x4 by, by measurements. Um, we have the Bosemani rainbow fish, and that is just a beautiful print. Of course, I don't have very good lighting. I could probably fix that, right? I don't know, that doesn't look like very good lighting if it's not like directly on anything. That's what you get with like an LED spotlight. Um, yeah, that kind of helps. Very nice picture. Um, all right, and then we have, I believe this is Bob's uh, Mabu Puffer. So this is little Steen right here and that's absolutely awesome. I'm a huge Puffer fan. Um, I'm hoping that in the future she does some artwork of her Fajaka once it gets a little bit bigger so that uh, I can also have some Fajaka artwork because I have a Fajaka. But this is absolutely awesome. So we have those two. And I'll show you guys real quick my frames that I went with. They were originally at Michael's in case you guys end up getting them and you're worried that your frames are going to cost you $20, $20 to $30 a piece. I got this for eight dollars, and that's before the sale price. Um, and that's an eight and a half by eleven inch, um, which I think would fit those bigger ones. But I got these for the smaller ones, and uh, they'll just center out like that. And I hope that there's white behind there. I might even have to buy like a little piece of poster, um, which I do have poster board for that. But they have little white mounting. Um, things that you can put in a picture frame that will mount smaller pictures in the center so you have a nice big white border. Um, but that's the plan. And this was $8 before the 60% off. And I believe their Michael's 60% off is only for today on Thursday, which I just like luckily walked in there and saw that. Um, and then for this bigger one, this was only $10. Now this already has a white border. Um, so... I want to like, I want to set this on these prints. Hopefully I'm not doing any of this wrong. Um, all of her hairs, dang it. Um, yeah, but then that should fit in there and it's going to have like a quarter inch overlay just around the border, which I think should be fine. Um, I don't know if that's ideal with a picture considering after years of light hitting this, that quarter inch will become discolored or this will be discolored by light and just because of UV radiation. Um, and then that little quarter inch will be nice and stark white while this will be a little bit bleached after years and years of uh, having the light shine on it. Uh, but that should take quite a few years. Uh, maybe I'm wrong about that. Maybe these prints are different, but I know when you go into like uh, the Elvis Presley Museums, there's no flash photography for that reason because light deteriorates stuff but um anyways those are the priscilla prints and now this is one i almost forgot about but um and i'll put links i'm going to put links to her etsy page in the description as well and then also i'll link to uh one of her youtube uh videos where she actually draws one of those because it's uh it's really fun to watch uh, i enjoy watching that stuff and then we also have a small little 
another unboxing envelope un, un enveloping I don't I don't know what to say yeah but um enveloping un enveloping so I got these from Flynn's Fish Form if you're not aware of who Flynn is uh you definitely should be um he's an amazing young YouTuber he's done collaborations with Steenfot Aquatics Cory from Aquarium Co-op um and quite a few other YouTubers he's been doing a lot of uh fish store tours recently and for for his age, uh, I mean, he's doing some impressive impressive work with his edits. Um, and I think you know Corey helped him out with uh, giving him a better camera. And I mean, by all means, he deserved it. Uh, there's not many kids in this day and age that are on YouTube that don't just go around like sub trolling, asking you know sub for sub to everyone that they can. I don't think Flynn has like ever done that. I'm pretty positive he hasn't. So. Uh, he's a hard worker who is very passionate about this hobby and uh, yeah he did a sticker giveaway I sent him my information via email and he originally got these stickers from Jadron Aquatics which is at Jadron Aquatics is actually somewhat local to me he's like a good hour maybe more away from me um, but Jadron did like a, a run of all the fish fam stickers and uh, Flynn took advantage of that and got some printed up for him and uh, uh, I can only fit so many stickers in my place, so um, I just got Flynn's, had him mail me some. So I'll link to some of Flynn's videos and channels as well in the description and maybe somewhere up here on this screen thing that you're looking at. Uh, definitely check him out and check Priscilla out. Um, they both do amazing work in the fish community and uh, I believe on their channels as well. done that was kind of stressful uh there was glitter like there was glitter in the shopping cart and it got on this paper and that like allowed it to get into stuff all right so it turns out i didn't have to move too many little objects now i could have put them right there and i would have liked to but i really like having my little map here because when somebody uh message me messages me or comments on a video and i learn where they are i want to be able to pinpoint I want to see, I, I see, I learn by seeing. So uh, uh, having this map here, uh, it helps me really understand where people are in the world and uh, you know, maybe what their weather or climate is like too. So it gives me an idea of just, you know, you know w what it's like where they're at. So I, I like having that there, very important. I was able to squeeze most of them in right here and um, uh, they fit well. I actually I had so I had a desktop that actually ended up just not working and I, I had the desktop literally mounted against the wall there. So uh, they actually worked out really great because they covered up the screw holes that I put in the walls. Um, and it looks like I might even have room for more. Now I don't have all of them here. With that being said, I could put them all here. But I, I'm I'm like probably the worst decorator as you guys probably can tell like look look that's that's one of my favorite corners of my room right by my front door my tool hanging place station and then storage I, I love storage you gotta love storage and fish tanks that's like the best decoration right is that not the best decoration all right these might be a little bit better decoration than a fish tank but fish tank is right after that and then tools are third um those count for tools as well digital tools so uh anyways yeah definitely happy to have them up on the wall and uh yeah just I, I feel like i'm going to be this much more inspired to work with my fish and my fish tanks now now that these are here i might install like a little led light right there that just comes on um like a very low wattage low light led that kind of comes on that illuminates those um and not directly, but just a little bit so that they can actually be seen because I really can't see the angel very well. But uh, I think I could get one more above the angel. And I don't have them all here, as you guys can already tell. Um, I've got one of the Bosmani, so I actually have two Bosmani. And uh, that's because Priscilla gave me, I believe, that larger print. And she also gave me this larger print. So this is where I put the Mabu, and that might change, but... Uh, I had a calendar up here that I just haven't been using, so I took it down, and this just went in its place, which is much, much better. Um, 
but I now have two Bozmani, and I mean two Bozmani. I think. Whoa! I think what I might do is uh, a giveaway on an upcoming video of a Bozmani Rainbow Fish. Um, I'll include. I, I don't know which size I'll, I'll do yet. Um, it'd be hard pressed to you know give that big one away. But I mean, you know, I. I could always buy another one, um, but yeah, with having two, I, I think um, I think I'm gonna give one away. So that being said, um, definitely stay tuned for the next few videos that are coming out. Um, there's probably going to be one of these up for grabs, and that'll include the frame and everything. Um, and it, I, I gotta say, it's likely going to be this one because, uh, yeah, she she gave me those two larger prints. And um, not to do this video or anything, she just, you know, uh, I think we've been friends for a little bit, so I think that's what you do. But um, yeah, so I think I'll do this one. And that being said, I'm going to get that extra if I give this one away. Yeah, I think I am. Um, I I'm going to get that extra little border for the outside of it. It's like six more dollars, uh, which is not a big issue. I paid three dollars and 20 cents for that frame. And uh, yeah, I'll ship you out the frame and I'll get that little border and everything and I'll finish that. Uh, I'll finish this out and uh, I'll get it, you know, centered and nice and uh, I won't mess it up at all. And then, uh, yeah, so in an upcoming video, I'll have, I'll have, a, I think, a small giveaway, I think. I keep saying I think because I don't enjoy doing giveaways. It's, it's work to do, you know, work. So, um, but, you know, it's, it's going to be very small. And uh, it'll be very quick, um, you know. Maybe I'll guess numbers or something odd like that. Uh, maybe I'll count how many how many babies baby fish I have in a tank somewhere, and I'll leave it up to you guys to guess, and whoever guesses uh, gets the picture. So, um, anyways, anyways, that's it for the video. Uh, Priscilla, thank you for the extra large, the two extra large prints that you gave me. Um, I'm definitely happy to have them, and. Um, yeah, for everyone else, um, next video, possibly giveaway. Keep your eyes open. It's probably not going to be in the title. Cause that's I don't like to necessarily do the giveaways like that. Just like to give them who, to you know whoever is there at the time. So um, that being said, definitely go check out Priscilla. Go check out her you know her time lapse art videos because those are absolutely amazing. Um, check out her Etsy store, links below, and also check out Flynn's Fish Forum because he is also making some amazing videos here on YouTube. He is one in a million, one in a hundred thousand, one in at least ten thousand of those kids that ask for nothing and only do and do their best. And it shows in his work. It shows on his YouTube channel. Um, so definitely go check him out, check Priscilla out, and I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you for watching.